Hello, ladies and gentlemen, and welcome back to my Paradox Mega Campaign, where we have the Palmyarne Empire. Man, I really wish the text wasn't so damn small. So, as a quick breakup of my new realm, I've reorganized the realm, that is Abyssinia, we have Arabia, the Shattered Remains of Jerusalem, that's controlled by Arabia, that's all controlled by Jerusalem, um, we have Syria, huh, well, transfer vassalage, rank, Count of Jaffa, no. I want to get rid of you. I want to put you under the king of Syria. Wait, wait, wait. Demand religious conversion. Yeah, apparently I cannot transfer the vassalage of him. I mean, under Jajuric Kingdom, yeah, it's, he's not a uh, actual vassal, but I'll see what I can do about it. Alright. Oh, More revolts. What an opening. Yes. Yeah, um, working on that right now, uh, as it stands, you know. Hmm. Okay, so I need to get, you know, I need to reign for another, t for a full ten years. We started in 327, so when that's 337. Uh, I can change my succession law to elective. Here's hoping I don't drop dead before then, and get taken over by this. Hmm, Manapurva becomes Ethiopian. And my wife is pregnant. Cultures. We're getting much more Ethiopian culture around here now, nicely. Man has converted to the Iconoclast face. Speaking of which, this is how far the Iconoclasm has come. I like it. And I should fill in the holes in my council that I created. Man, you are a god. Get to work. Fourteen for my spy master. Yeah, there we go. Yeah, he's the best I got. Um, he's the best I got. Anything better, Marshall? Nah, I didn't think so. But oh well. So yeah, I now have several kings under me, which is rather nice. What's my monthly prestige gain? Yeah, 1330. Wow. Yeah, six vassal kingdoms. Wow. That's impressive. So my heir is unmarried. Uh, matrilineal marriage. It really doesn't matter. Because we're both at the same dynasty, but whatever. There, that way my uh, first in succession line is protected. Speaking of which, what am I going to do with the Duke of Cyprus? I want to transfer him under Syria as well, but... It appears I can't do that, and I have no idea why. I should be able to, and I don't see any reason I can't. Speaking of which, with uh, Sicily and... Ooh, what do you know, I got a son. How useful. Not an imbecile. Always double check that on your firstborn kid. Jaffa? What did he. Jaffa is part of Ascalon, yes? 
Here's the Duke of Ascalon, right? Transfer Vassalage. They tried to escape. I'm putting them right back under them. Problem fixed. Except you're under Sinai. Oh well. I need to nominate... Queen, King, 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 King. My son, and raise crown authority to medium in Nubia. Probably want to just go for max in Nubia, I think. Not interested. As I said, yeah, we've got Nubia now, shown here. Digital Empire. I probably screwed up here. I meant to make this part of the Palmyra and Empire, but it appears I failed. Sure. Uh, oh well. That's fine. Hmm. Chancellor showed up dead, and darn, he was a good one. Oh well. Yeah, it, does, it seems once I handed out that Jerusalem title, I also seem to have lost my uh, de jure claim. It appears only the King of Jerusalem can press it. Which is a bit of a shame, but... Arabian Holy War for Neford. That's the other thing, I suppose, about having kings as vassals. I mean, look at that list. We've got the King of Arabia, Queen of Armenia, King of Jerusalem, bunch of dukes and stuff in there. Duke of Sinai, Herer, everything else. I mean, wait, Herer shouldn't... What? Eh. Herer's down here, right? There. I'm gonna say, how'd he get in? Doesn't he have a liege? Oh, well, who knows. But, uh, yeah, the power of the realm on its own is amazing now. Because there is such a more organized force. Equally so, that can come to bite me back in the ass if I'm not careful. Suppose the moral of the story is everything's a two-twin blade, or whatever. I forgot to declare the war, didn't I? No, I actually declared the war first this time. That's a significant improvement for me. Uh, alright, well. So she has a random barony up here. Alright, whatever. I, was, I thought that was telling me because it was one of my vassals or something. Like one of my baronies. The hacky mids are starting to fight it off. We've got Brittany leading the Reconquista. Impressively, Barcelona survives. Hmm... And the HRE is strong, as always. <laughs> of course, they've been in civil war for quite some time now, and it appears they have several breakaway states. I know uh, several points down in Sicily have managed to break off, which I like. I do wish to take control of the Kingdom of Sicily, if at all possible. Hmm. Holy war for that. I always support uh, my counselors when they have ideas on improving the realm. So Oman is busy being crushed. I can capture Oman and hand it over to the king of Arabia. Like I said, my vassals should now help me expand the realm. Now a lot of people are asking why I don't plan to push into Persia. I do. Don't get me wrong. I do. It's just not yet. Is the point. Whoa, 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 whoa. I don't know how many I just lost there, but... Um, to prevent more disasters, split into two groups. You go there. You go there. Alright, so we got three groups of 7,000. And they've got three provinces, and then I can launch a scale, full-scale invasion on the Nardids. And 
and slowly but surely I'm sure we'll get some claims. Gizeh, Almian, Alexandria. I don't know why I have a claim on that. Speaking of which... Oops, I botched that. He's supposed to be uh, my religious head. Whoa, 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 whoa. This doesn't look good. Stutter, diligent, trusting. Trusting, slothful, greedy, stutter. Hmm, darn. <sighs> oh well, I suppose not all my kings can be perfect. Alright, so now we've got some of that. I say we begin the invasion of uh, Oman, which did manage to declare independence, luckily. Imprison. No. Where's my marshal? Imprison. I will have his head. This is the other danger of having family members. <laughs> they uh, aren't exactly your most faithful companions as it were. Which is actually, I think, really kind of silly at just how much family members murder each other in this. It's a bit overboard. Don't think he has any troops that he can raise, really. I think he, uh, isn't he attacking elsewhere right now? It's range. Ag. Become kind, since that's rather worrying. She's probably my best shot right now. Yeah. The first sieges should be easier. Why is there ever a garrison of 3,000? I don't know. There should be no reason for any of this to have a garrison of 3,000. Okay, either way, um... Oh well, uh, alright then. Am I gonna complete, like, several sieges at once or something? Because that seems like a really awkward idea, like 1,700. And 1,300. 1,311, I guess that's... Yeah, I guess I'm sieging the city here. Alright, fair enough. I suppose. At least the rest of these should go a little quicker then. Picked up the siege where the uh, rebels left off. Makes sense. Yeah, it seems I do that. It means that the other sieges should go faster at least. <laughs> Antiochia has converted to the Iconoclast Faith again. The Iconoclast Faith is spreading nicely. I have my own last couple of provinces to clean up still, which is taking me a really annoyingly long time. And I've become kind. How nice. Well, at least she's not turning out too bad. I 
I need to try and rain for, uh... Oh, what? I've had another sun. How useful. Cynical, diligent, slothful. Prod, wrath, diligent, cruel. Humble, craven, trusting. Let's go with this. Alright. Uh, yeah, here, just have the money. <laughs> yeah, I'll deal with him later. And then I'll give him to uh, Jerusalem and him to the Alexandrian Patriarch. I think that's an acceptable way to divide up the old realm. But, uh, yeah, this is my new empire that I've managed to divide up a fair bit. I don't think any of them will uh, assimilate unless I own like the entire kingdom of it, which I don't actually with any of them. <laughs> Sorry guys, we're back. Somebody again locked in and started talking to me. We know that everyone's favorite pastime is bothering me while I'm recording. People leave me alone for hours, and then the second I start recording, everyone's bothering me. Anyway, uh, yeah, I'm doing recording inside my usual time because I'm actually going to a LAN party this weekend at my brother's house, where we're going to be ending up probably playing a pile of League of Legends, so I'm trying to get the recording done so I can, you know, upload it and try and... <coughs> try and get everything done. Hmm. Well, at least it appears Oman will capitulate any time now. Not too many cedars to go. Hmm. Yeah, they're far enough away. Honesty. Alright, and... I will use it. That's a good start. Huh. Slothful Roth Craven, Trusting Diligent Craven, Craven Diligent Cynical. Yeah, trusting is fine, I think. Hmm. Pelusia. Excellent, excellent. That means only two more provinces in my realm I have to convert. Hmm, the Caliph seems to still have some claws. I need to be cautious, it would appear. Well, let's just enforce these demands here. Perfect. Drop levies. Uh, create the title of the Duchy of Oman. Um, go through and do this. Why am I only giving up the churches, you ask? Well... It's mostly just because uh, they grant you piety for giving them up. I don't really care what happens to the provinces otherwise. The king can use them to strengthen his position. Grant landed title. Duchy of Oman and everything below that. Excellent, yes. And now again, let's raise my own personal levies. I believe Varama needs to be smashed into tiny, tiny bits. Another Kaelvin. Just because I have a strange feeling you never know, this one might turn up dead. For whatever reason. Totally not my goddamned family members or anything. Yeah. 
has reigned for at least 10 years is at peace and no vassals fighting each other. Oh well. <sighs> so yeah, for his crime he will be, you know, imprisoned. I will revoke his title. I will give... Hmm. I still have a claim to Burahaya, don't I? Which I believe means it should be free to revoke. I guess I don't, darn. Yeah, I'm pretty sure he's not. It actually makes them a heretic if you tell if you say that they are a heretic. It's kinda counterintuitive to actually do it. You will be slightly better. Well, I'm not really worried about inter-realm politics, so as long as they don't actually involve me, I'm fine with it. Siege of Mutt, yet again, some more. So yes, for those of you who haven't seen, we now have Nubia here to replace mainland Egypt. Abyssinia, encompassing its normal realm, and Arabia here. For people wondering, I did uh, mod Nubia to have this. I just figured this was probably the easiest way to divide it up without all my vassals hating me for having any land or any kingdom titles. Because, you know, if I held on to Abyssinia, then, uh, minus 20 wanting the kingdom of Abyssinia. Oop, if I didn't, you know, move this into Nubia, the king of Abyssinia would want my head because demands deserve vassals, yada yada yada. There, there's no way to win the division without doing something along these lines. So, in the end, I think I think I did what was probably uh, just the best outcome that didn't involve somebody ha having like a malice of either a bunch of vassals having a malice of twenty or one vassal having a malice of like six hundred for wanting a pile of crap. and or trying to kill the patriarch here. I know she did that a lot when I uh, ran a quick test game. Uh, my daughter? No. Oh, no, 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 no. I have a couple of kids and another woman in line. She can be useful. Hmm. The Duke of Lombardy. Duke of Ryazan. Yeah, send her to Russia. Except. Eh, that doesn't matter, I guess. Flatter and soothe him. Ah, uh, yes, apparently that's something else that is rather annoying that my uh, Demesne laws are reset. Hmm. Four level eight point five. Not even gonna attempt to assault that. And you, sir. Go back to researching military tech in Cairo. We have a lot of work to do in this regard. Except... Revoke title. The county of Ramaya, or Burhaya. That is not, yeah, minus 20 with everyone. Yeah, sure, and then I'll ransom him. And grant a landed title. Let's try and restore that. Barahaya. 40 piety, or piety from church grant, 50, not bad. 
There we are. Oh, that's a good heal just revolt again anyway, I think. No, he isn't. How oh, useful. He won't actually revolt. I should clean up these rebels while I have my troops in range. It's the neighborly thing to do, I suppose. Speaking of which, time for another round of upgrades. In all the provinces I control. Wait, what? Huh, apparently that just didn't have a large castle city. I can't believe I missed that. Apparently they don't all have that. Alright, what did I... I guess castle Donjon. Upgrade that. Upgrade that, and finally, upgrade that. And in Cairo, 800. No. Eh. Suppose it get, can't get everything that way. University still can't be made until, uh, down in structure level 4. <clears throat> but, uh, yeah, I would say this is good for the first episode back. Now is the Palmyran Empire. Ah, my son needs a guardian. Of course. the emperor himself, as is tradition. And screw the people who yell at me saying, oh, get them trained by Midas Touch at the last second. Like I said here, I'm not going to be too gamey. I'm trying to, you know, steer a bit away from that. Don't want to have to. And Pierce is an actual Duke of Oman. Or something. Uh, who knows. Wow, the Fatimids, uh, apparently, yeah, th I say we, Genosian War for Emirate of Tunis. Um, hmm, I guess he's the Invasion CB? I guess he used the invasion CB. Okay then. Huh. Yes, well. So yeah, um Golden Horde is actually holding together. Poland's gotten its crap back together, the HRE. Kind of fallen apart a bit, so Scotland now. Will Brittany manage to... no. Hey, wow, the Kingdom of Aquitaine. Wasn't expecting that. That's pretty neat. So yeah, that uh that's the current state of affairs here. Wow, well, the Byzantine Empire's gone frat silly. <laughs> How does this even happen? Not only has it gone Catholic, but it's gone heretical. I am I just I don't even know. Hey wow, I mysteriously seem to have picked this up. That's nice. <laughs> uh, I'm just kind of expecting random wars to break out around here as my vassals start taking their Dejure lands. Armenia especially to go on some kind of like power offensive over here and just take this. But uh, yeah, I keep on dragging this on because I love to talk. But uh, until next time, this is Kelvin signing off.